In this video, we're going to take a look at how you factory reset a TP-Link Powerline TL-AP4010 adapter. The adapter is part of the AV600 Powerline Wi-Fi kit, which also includes a TL-WPA4220 extender. As the TLPA4010 adapter has no physical reset switch, we will need to first download the TP PLC utility for either Windows or Apple Macintosh. Using your browser, if you enter uk.tplink.com forward slash download dash center dot html, you're taken to the download center. Next, using the drop down filter options, select home, network expansion, power line adapters. From the list of power line adapters, locate the model of power line device that you are using. In this example, we are using the TLWPA4220 kit. When we select the link, we are shown the downloads for that power line adapter. If you are experiencing issues with your adapter, you could try updating its firmware. However, to update the firmware or reset the adapter, you will need to use the TP PLC utility. Within Utility, there are three downloadable options which include the Utility applications for both Mac and PC and a tool to scan for Powerline devices. You will need to download and install the appropriate TP PLC utility for the computer you are working from. When we load the TP PLC utility, a scan is performed of our home network to detect any power line devices that we have connected. In this example, you can see the power line extender, the connection speed, and the power line adapter that we're looking to factory reset. If we select Advanced, you can see the settings we can adjust on the Powerline adapter. There are three primary options, Quality of Service, Update and Mode. Let's factory reset the Powerline adapter. If we select Basic and then Reset, we can reset the device back to factory defaults. You will notice on the front of the TLPA4010 adapter that the indicator lights all briefly go out. When the three indicator lights light up again, the adapter will have been reset. Factory resetting the TLPA4010 adapter will not reset any pairings you may have with your power line extenders. However, after the adapter has been reset, the utility will not show any power line extenders until after the utility has been refreshed. Instead, a factory reset will only reset the user adjustable basic and advanced options. So to recap, we've looked at where you can download the TP PLC utility, taken a look at the options within the utility, and then used the utility to reset the TLPA4010 adapter back to factory defaults.